Hey, Christopher Gill here. Um, I have built my business over the last seven years on doing infill real estate and understanding the process of how you work in urban, already built downtown areas and, and how you improve the value. Um, and wanted to make a quick video because I see a lot of people um, purchasing homes, and I've done this before, and this is kind of as I transitioned into doing more new construction and these small urban developments. This will be, this will be four total units here um, condos, townhouse style condos, uh, near downtown San Antonio. And, and so th the, there's a lot of power that you will have as an urban developer by looking at your per door cost and creating density on pieces of land. So what we had here, there was a home somewhere over there. And, and I bought it and it, it's on a street. There's a neat little bar district right down the road that way. And um, in, instead of flipping the house or rehabbing the house, this, this lot was big enough. The dimensions were good enough. The zoning was good at this time. So we didn't, we were able to move right into pre-development on this project. And, um, and so instead of having one home that was in really, really bad shape, would be a, a ton of work to do, we went ahead and did four units on here. So they're gonna be new construction units. That means they're gonna be, um, you know, more expensive to build, but I, I know my costs all the way through the project, right? I know exactly how many, how much per foot it's going to cost me. And I have a much better idea of my, my exit value on a property. And I know there's not going to be any issues. We're going to have a structural warranty on it that gets sold to a, a warranty company. And we are able to take the value that would have been in just one home, one flip, and maybe make, maybe make 30, 50 grand. And, and now we've got a, a million dollar plus project. We'll probably sell it to these units from between like 350 to about 480. So um, we'll have well over a million dollars of sold value in these four units. Our returns are way up. The project is much more predictable and, and we paid up for the land, right? So this, this was a, a property that other people were saying no to. And I knew that because I was looking at the deal differently that I could make this and I could make it something that really, really made sense. Um, so when you're looking at land, you need to be analyzing it based on the per door cost of your property and that needs to be your exit not the overall price and it may be a way that you can um, capture a lot of deals that maybe other people are saying no to um, hope this was helpful and um, happy investing everybody